So these guys are eating nice food. And I have nothing. <laughs> the comfort zone. Last week I saw a video by Click for Taz in which she lived off of vending machines in London for a full day. And it's safe to say she didn't have a grand old time. Oh, if I only knew how hard it was going to be. I know in Japan they have plenty. I, ugh, if I did this in Japan, I would have been thriving. But I am in Japan, so it should be easier here, right? Well, challenge accepted. Today I'm eating and drinking only from vending machines. By the way, if you like my content, definitely check out Taz's channel. You'll love it. This week my little brother is visiting me in Japan, and therefore I would love to spend some quality time with him. And because of that, the video might be a little bit shorter, then you're used to. Sue me. Now, Japan is a promised land when it comes to vending machines. You see them everywhere. In fact, there's one machine for every 23 people. Hello. That's more vending machines than there are people in Belgium. Now, for the first part of the day, I'm going to check out a place that might just be a myth because it sounds too good to be true. In Osaka, you can find the only 10 yen vending machines in Japan. Only one of them in Japan. Ah, uh, really, really. 10 yen is roughly a dime or 10 euro cents. The catch is you can't see what's inside. However, unfortunately, this little red light says it's sold out. They did have one selling cheap water, so I could at least get hydrated. The first coin of the day. And so the addiction started. There is a drink containing salt. Let's give it a try. That's good. That's that's really good. I am such a hipster. I am such a hipster. And that's when I found one more lottery machine. Now there's still one lucky machine here that's a little bit more expensive. Let's go for this one. Let's hope it's food. I hope it's food. No, it's another drink. Uh, the first stop, no food. So let's hope I can find breakfast somewhere. I went on my way to pick up my brother and friend with my first loot in hand. This peach drink is so sweet. Oh, and kids, don't forget to recycle. I picked up the guys and I immediately treated them to a round of vending drinks. We zijn hier dus aan, jongens. En we hebben weer een machine gevonden. We found another machine. Yay. But finding food seemed quite a challenge. These guys are eating nice food. And I have nothing. <laughs> it is almost three o'clock. And I'm still looking for breakfast. I probably, I probably won't make it. <laughs> Going all the way up till dark without finding a single bit of food. It is starting to get dark. And I still haven't found any food. I'm just checking every single machine I see. But it's just drinks. So even at your local dental clinic, they have the machine with sugary water. So I just Googled and apparently you can find hot soup in some of these machines. And I think I actually saw them today, but I didn't know it was soup. I found it. Corn soup, corn soup. <laughs> corn soup, no, 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 corn soup, yeah. corn soup. Oh, it's warm. Feel it. Oh, oh I should have shaken it. There's corn in it! There's corn in it! There's corn in it! <laughs> I'm gonna get another one of these. Wanna try? Food! Food! <laughs> I've got three cans of soup. Yay! Let's go. <laughs> and then my luck turned around and I started finding food left and right. So I knew right after this I was gonna find more of them. But maybe it was just my eyes being open to new possibilities. So now I have four cans of soup. I think I'm definitely getting diabetes tonight. This is... What do you call those uh, Shrimps. Shrimp. Shrimp soup. <laughs> To 
celebrate, I treated the boys to more sugary drinks. And you, the viewer, to some clumsiness. Good! Good, good. Oh, my money fell. Now, my next problem is that I have all my pocket stuff with soup. And I have nowhere to put my camera. Uh, I got one here. One in here. One in there. One over there. The soup is literally made by Coca-Cola. Everything's made by Coca-Cola. I'm just gonna have shots of me buying stuff from vending machines. Kids, you gotta stay hydrated. Then I heard about arcades possibly having food vending machines, so I checked them out, and not without success. Look what I just found. Ooh! This one has peanuts. So it's probably the best bang for my buck. I don't remember the last time I was so happy to eat ice cream. I just got another ice cream. Why? Because I'm afraid I'm not gonna find anything else. I also found some stuff that was completely useless to me. Now unfortunately I cannot eat this. There's like a tiny speaker over here. That's not gonna go in my belly. But after that I ran into some proper protein when I walked past this hotel and I was having them. Both of them. I was set now. Although after that I even found a bean soup. It literally smells like warm beans. Oh, it's sweet. Now I was really sad for food. Actually, I was feeling quite full, but I wanted to have some fun as well. I think I found enough food now, but I found something to end the video with. Look at this. And it's a vending machine. If only I had a cat to put it on. Let me know if you have one. Maybe I'll send it to you. I'm gonna try this because it looks weird. We finished it off with a late night drink at the park and we called it a night. I had a great day of treasure hunting. Yes, it was pretty uncomfortable and I was quite hungry for most of the day, but in the end it wasn't that bad and I can even say I have eaten comfortably. I wouldn't say it's a healthy way to live though, and not very social, but it is convenient. <coughs> what a day. Um, my voice is terrible. Uh, I feel like shit because I didn't eat anything nutritious today, I think. But I did it. It's done. It's over with. I thought it was going to be very comfortable and I would find like an amazing vending machine with sushi in it, but I didn't. I hope you guys liked this video. Like, subscribe, comment down below if you liked it and stuff like that. Watch more of the videos and then I will see you in the next adventure.